All right, so here we are at our county residence back in good old Kentucky, Jefferson County. We're in a, a creek close to our house in Louisville. And guys, if you recognize the creek, don't mention it in the comments. That's the worst thing you can do is reveal locations. You'll have people at your spots flipping metal that they didn't put out. It's not good. So we're looking for two species here today. It's the queen snake, which is uh, Regina septum vitata, and the northern water snake. It's an intergrade zone, so they're going to be mixed with midlands, and that is uh, Nerodia sipidon, and the midland is Pluralis. So here's a good spot. We're going to start flipping rocks, and we'll be back if we find anything. First find for today is a soft tail shell turtle. Dustin, do you know if this is a spiny soft shell or just a normal? It's a spiny. Spiny soft shell. How cool. Just seeing this guy laying on the on the ground, just basking. This is actually a lifer for me. I'm not sure if Dustin's found more before. Is this a lifer for you? No. I've found quite a few. Not ever that small. Really, really cool. Little female, by the way the tail looks. But we're gonna let her go and then keep on looking. All right, guys. First snake of the day is a northern water snake, Nerodia sipidon. As I mentioned before, it's intergrade zone, so it's a combination of the midland and the uh, the northern. There's a belly shot of the ventrals. Um, it's a good-looking snake, probably a yearling. First snake of the day. I'm sure we're going to find a ton more. This creek here is loaded with uh, queen snakes, especially. I found a few water snakes, but not as many as the queens. But uh, we're going to let this guy down and keep on. So here you go. Back to the rock I found him under. All right. Yeah. Water snake. Yep. The little baby water snake. So, number two. So these guys are, uh, you know, these guys will eat anything. These are like water erasers, basically. They'll eat whenever they're big size. Of course, these things will get, you know, I've I've seen them three feet long, close to 40 inches. But they will literally eat anything. They'll eat turtles. They'll eat fish. They'll eat baby ducklings, crawfish. They'll eat other snakes. You name it, they can swallow it. They'll eat it. But uh, yeah, snake number two. Yeah, these things, oh, these things like to bite for a first minute or two, but once you got them, they they kind of settle down. But if we catch any big ones, I'm not going to be grabbing them. I'll let Madison show you guys those. I don't like to get bit by big snakes. <laughs> kind of a wimp. But yeah, number two. All right, guys, here's snake number four. Number three got away, but uh, this one looks like it's blue. A little bit bigger. Uh, another northern, so we're gonna keep trucking. See you in a second. You ready? Mm-hmm. Wow. Oh, I can't a, believe that. Yeah, that was a good one. Need yeah, to flip that little rock. Nope. What about this one? Wow, oh, man. Oh. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, yeah, shit. I, I got fucking it. kill it, didn't I? No, you got it. It's in shed, but it is what you were looking for. All right. So, this is a queen snake. It is a uh, Regina Septum Vitata. Septum Vitata. Yeah, so here's a snake five, was a northern water snake. And there's the, I'm gonna let this guy go real quick. So okay. Here we go. I'm gonna wash this one off. He is kind of, he has some uh, spider webs on him. Okay. All right guys, so here's the target for the day. This looks like another yearling snake. This is 
got some this one's pretty beat up but anyhow this is septum vitata it's just a uh, queen snake so septum translates to seven and vitata translates to lines so this one you can't see because it's blue but typically these guys will have as yearlings or smaller snakes they'll have seven lines going down them and they'll fade out as they grow you can't see this one because it's you know it's in it's blue but uh there's a ventral these things always got two black stripes on the ventral there's those and uh you'll see a bigger one later these things will you know they go from green to tan white i've seen them yellow before but they're re really super common here in this creek uh in kentucky i guess they range from the bluegrass where they're really common down to the knobs where we are and then they go a little further south into uh, the mississippi plateau but only on the east side and then the eastern coal field but only on the west side so that's like south central kentucky uh, these things are crawfish specialists they only eat freshly molted crawfish which give out like an enzyme and the craw and the and the snake knows you know that it's soft to eat and they'll eat them so snake uh number one well actually number six mm -hmm. but number one target species i'm gonna try to find 20 or 30 of these it's not uncommon i've been down here before and found like 30 in like two hours so we're shooting for 20 of these today so there's number one okay there you go Tons of minnows here, guys. You know, I don't, I don't know what kind of fish they are, but some type of minnow. But there is literally hundreds. Probably you can't see them on camera, but I can see them. Tons of them. Oh, yeah, you can't see them. Yeah. Anyways. Guys, look at this habitat. This is perfect. So we've done found uh, like seven snakes. Uh, a soft shell turtle. This water feels amazing. Yeah. And this habitat's great, you know, for queen snakes. That's what we came out for today. So, this is kind of habitat they like. Clean water, it's flowing with lots of shrubs, vegetation to hide for them and their prey. Crawfish, freshly molted. Um, rock, rocks everywhere, a rocky bottom. This is what they like, guys. There's fish everywhere. There's crawfish everywhere. Uh, and this is the season to find big, adult, fat, pregnant. Uh, yeah. And gravid. Uh, Our seventh snake for the day. A, uh, another common water there snake. Were, there were two under that rock, but the other one got away. Yeah, two under the rock, these two were sharing a rock. This one, I'm probably gonna try to take some pictures of. It is pretty nice, aside from its attitude. Yeah, nice common water snake. That's uh, very bitey. We'll uh, get back with you when we find more. All right, guys. I just flipped another water snake. So it's like eight or nine. I don't know. We'll review later. But this is what I'm talking about. This is what we came to find. This is a big, fat, adult female gravid. It's a big snake. I'm going to grab it. There we go. I'm going to hold this snake for Madison. She's a... Uh, off taking photos of um, a turtle and another water snake. Queen snake. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, I'm gonna go take this to her so we can get some photos. And that's it. Alright guys, here is that same queen snake I just flipped. So, uh, Regina, Septum Vitata, again. Crayfish specialists are only going to eat crayfish freshly molted soft. We're talking, you know, the consistency of like a, 
like a hard boiled egg or you know kind of like jello but she was bitey at first never actually hit me but uh she's calmed down i think madison wants to take some pictures so uh here's a good ventral this one is solid it's not really any pattern there's no gray in this particular individual i see a lot of gray in her belly there's a little gray there but no tan or any yellowing just a big hulking female gravid with you know probably a dozen babies or more live birth they're not going to lay eggs guys yeah that's what we came for you want to do some photos yeah. all right same queen snake madison got her pictures so i'm going to release this girl hopefully we find her again we'll come back down in a few weeks and see if we can find some some babies but there she goes Oh, a queen snake, two of them. Two queens, you get them both? Yeah. Two queen snakes. Can you see any this pattern? This one that's, I have by the tail is really blistered up. Will you put that one down? I'll just go ahead and release him. Yeah. Yeah, that's definitely a boy. Mm -hmm. Oh, dropped him. He's fine. This one actually has some no blisters on like the other one. This one, you can really see that pattern on the belly. Really, really nice. So queen snakes, um, three and four. Cool. He has some really nice neck. You can uh, really see the pattern on his neck, that really tan stripe. Looks like he actually is in blue. Water snake. Water snake? Yeah, ditched it, got away on me. All right. Anyhow, another water snake. I'm gonna go ahead and let this guy go. Nice looking. So another northern water. Nerodia Sipidon. Oh, look at his tail. Ooh, that's bad. That looks like something, a shed issue. Poor little guy. That's probably gonna end up falling off. Uh, definitely a boy. You can actually see he has a little uh, water stuff snake. coming out. Another little baby one. Yeah, hammering me. Calm him down and just get a picture. Does he have a meal in his belly? Uh, he looks like he might. Looks like it. I'll, I'll put him down. Yeah, go ahead and put him down. This one is really nice looking. I wish that uh, issue on his tail wasn't there. Oh, That's another water really snake. odd. Another water snake. We'll get him in a minute. I've seen the rocky one under. But really neat. I'm going to go ahead and set this guy down so we can uh, get some hands on some other ones. All right. This rock is where that water snake went, and I bet you there's a queen under here with it. Uh, nope. Nope. Ah, damn. I was expecting him to be under there for sure. Might be under one of these. There it is. That's the one I just seen that got away. <laughs> Another water snake. How many snakes does this make for the day so far, Dustin? Shoot, I don't know. We'll have to review. Really nice. Another queen snake. Another queen? Yep. So queen number Is that five. one? No, I have still. This one's got blisters too. I wonder what's going on. Yeah, queen snake number five. And a water snake. Yeah, they've all got blisters. Must have been a bad winter for them. Mm-hmm. We'll go ahead and let these two guys go and uh, keep on looking. Just as soon as we cut off, we actually found a decent looking uh queen snake this one i don't believe is in blue just a little bit dry really nice another little queen snake yeah queen snake that one was just it was just sitting, sitting there. there all right so this is a nice looking one i might get a picture of him nice Some little more. young one some not more. as bad as the other one, so what? still them blisters going on though. That's really yeah. odd. It's gotta be a bad winter for them. So that's more like Queen Snake Six. Queen Snake Six. And no idea what count on the water snakes is. No, nah, we'll review and that guy's no way. Alright, I'm gonna get some quick photos of this guy since he's in pretty good condition and we'll keep on filming when we find more. 
queen snake. Two queen snakes. Two queen? Don't lift it yet. All right. Hold it. Careful. Try. It's another grab the female, looks like. Yeah. That one's very green. Here, yeah, hold on. You're good. Yeah. I don't see anything. Watch out, real quick. Watch out. There she is. Alright, guys, here's Queen Snakes number seven and number eight. This one's small, but. Gravid. Looks gravid to me. Mm -hmm. There's the ventral of the small one. Really vibrant. It looks like in this area, these are not retaining any juvenile pattern. But there's the ventral, the big one. The big one has really nice olive this, color to her. Both of these snakes look really good. Oh yeah. I might actually get a picture this of that. This one is photo female. worthy. Them other ones on that side were uh, all blistered up, but these two were look, look, look good. Really nice, yeah. I'm just going to get a picture of the female. You can go ahead and let that male go. All right, there he goes. You want to flip this the rest of the way? Yeah, I'm going to flip this. See, this is another thing, guys. We were... Okay. I wasn't even going to flip this. And Madison was like, oh, I bet you there's something under there. And sure enough, two queen snakes. So don't pass on trash. There's another queen there's snake. There's a queen snake tail right there. See it? Yep. Hand of water. Oh, my oh, God. Goodness three of them here hold that that's nine here's number ten and another water snake got away man i don't know if i can get this yeah you might just have to there's that water snake got him maybe we lift up that rock under him almost uh, almost <laughs> there you go oh, oh there's more snakes under there there's like uh, another there's another water snake uh, under lost there him. it's okay uh, Oh man, <laughs> got away from me. That's what you call a good rock flip. All right, watch out. So that there was like there was like four. there was like seven snakes under that rock. Yeah. So I like four queens. Four queens. And like three. Three water snakes. Three there water was definitely snakes. two smaller ones other than this guy. I couldn't get it. Don't pass on the trash. Oh yeah, that's some of the best stuff. Whew, goodness. I think you about got me. Gonna release this water snake. Hammer and Madison right now. Yeah. Man, that was a good flip. Okay, go on, little guy. And I'm gonna be getting a picture of this girl. Yeah, she looks good shape. She looks nice, really nice olive color. The other one I've seen that I got pictures of was still kind of blistered. Not really uh, photo worthy like this one is. But we're gonna cut it right here and we'll uh, start it back up again when we find more. Cool. All right, guys, another Nerodia, Sipidon. There are so many of these down here. I've never found this many in a single day down here. Normally it's 20 queen snakes, but I think we found like maybe a dozen. But yeah, so we're in Jefferson County. A lot of people will say, you know, we have a uh, cottonmouth, the Keystradon, Piscovorus, but we do not. The closest they come is like uh, probably like Southwest Butler County and then uh, you got a decent population in Hopkins County of Cottonmouth uh, but none around Jefferson County anything you can see it's gonna be this right here around any of the big lakes like Green River Nolan anything like that so yeah there you go I just flipped this rock Another Nerodia, Sipidon. I'm gonna try to get this thing out. Just bear with me for one second. Anyway, there it goes. There's no need to pick up another one. And another one, look at that. Another Nerodia. Man, that's like 20 on the day. They're everywhere down here, guys. It's like if I turn the camera off, I'm gonna miss. I'm gonna miss everything. But I don't want to bore you guys. Hopefully, you're not bored. It's a damn good snake day. It's super hot, so it's really not much else to do but water snakes. Rodeo up under this one. I seen them go under there. 
but there could be a queen snake just gotta move some stuff out of the way first all right here we go yeah and right there damn queen snake just got away hopefully oh i see it i see it i see it where'd it go right there i got it queen snake right there nice one it's got a mill in its belly i was hoping that we would find more of these today but it's like a man it's like a water snake day for sure not finding a lot of regina i mean i guess we're up to you know over a dozen but yeah that's a good day i'm gonna let this one go and keep flipping here we go hope you all enjoyed the video me and dustin think we're done for today it's been a good day for looking inside creeks for queen snakes and water snakes uh found a soft-shelled turtle that's something that i wasn't was not expecting to find um i hope you all enjoyed the video uh i'll be posting again next wednesday hopefully it will be down in a more central part of kentucky uh and links to the description below uh it's oh yeah you got anything else to say yeah uh don't pass on the trash and leave no stone unturned because you've seen what we just pulled out of that trash guys see you next week <laughs>